Ghost Girl coming in with the first. Welcome. I'm Alipo Stefan. You are part of the squad, and I thank you for being here. What up? What up, everybody? I hope everyone's having a wonderful Friday. I cut out work a little early. Uh, Should have did some more adulting. I thought I would have a little more time, or I had less time, but should have done it. But what abs? We streaming. We're going to stream for a while. We're going to do our diamond hunt. We get everything loaded up. We need to get his elf. Like I was saying the other day on the stream, we're turning down the audio just a little bit in the background. Uh, I want to get the shiny as elf as soon as possible so we can get the pokey radar so we can join Reversal's uh, shiny challenge with Twitch affiliate streamers. Or anybody, really, so... I would like to do that. I think that would be a lot of fun. Uh, and it gives us a chance to hunt for shinies. Just Sean's going to be very upset if I have to, like, cheat it. Sean, dude, Sean, Sean, Sean. Today, I'm sorry, man. If I don't get shiny today, I am killing it. I'm killing Uxie. I'm beating the Elite Four. And that's so I can join Reversal's streamer challenge uh for a chance to win a thousand dollars and do it's whoever gets the longest chain so i have to have the pokey radar i'm sorry man i was waiting for you to pop in the other night but 4700 that is crazy oh my god almost 4800 dude shine that is crazy oh dude That's crazy. I'm sorry. That's rough. What about speed running the game on the other profile? So you got the poor face shiny as elf after all this. Well, I would have to beat the game on that profile. But I don't have to forfeit shiny as elf. So the thing is, is if I beat Yuxi and as elf now, kill them, I go beat the elite four, it respawns the legendaries. So I should, in theory, be able to come back here and just start doing this again. I would just have to... Yeah, I would just have to kill it instead of capturing it. That's what I was told. I'm not 100% on it myself, but I have had multiple people tell me that. But no, I am not 100% on that. But, again, I want to join Reversal's stream challenge uh, for affiliates. I think it's good exposure. It's a chance to win $1,000 and 100 gifted subs. Or 100 gifted subs to start. So it would be 200 for the grand prize winner. OG Diamond, you can't plant them, you could. Gonna have to look it up, I guess. 
I'm not 100% sure. Toaster, what up, man? Welcome to the stream, buddy. Sean, you as well, by the way. Um, but yeah, I've had, uh, I think it was Eyeshot. I had my brother, Murdero. And I had somebody else all tell me you could. Again, I just think it's a good opportunity for some exposure, get more views on the channel, uh, win a fun competition, maybe forge a partnership, relationship. Hello. Hello, little brother. What up? Welcome to the stream. We're talking about the game plan going forward. Uh, one of YouTubers Reversal or Streamers Reversal, if you don't know him, he used to play Pogo, does a lot of Pokemon content. He's known as the Phoebus guy. He basically hunted Phoebus and Sword and Shield at full odds forever and never got it. Shiny, that is. Uh, he's holding a competition. Enjoy that you're inside. Oh, yeah, I am. I left early. I used some PTO for it. Um, he's holding a competition with some st uh, streamers and affiliates, or partners and affiliates in Twitch. And it's just whoever can create the longest chain. And be to be able to do that, we need to have the Pokey Radar, which you can't have until you have the National Dex. And for us to have the National Dex, we need his elf and Mess or Yuxi. And we still have not gotten it. So we either need to get it today or tomorrow. Tomorrow's actually our last chance because I have to sign up by Sunday, it looks like. Um, we have two more days, really, to get shiny as elf before we kill it we kill yuxi we go beat the elite four and it should respawn them so that's the game plan so we're able to participate in the competition uh again good exposure i think it'll be fun uh i don't know how many we can get we're gonna have to do a little bit of practice pre-hand Might have to do that Sunday night. Just practice and practice and practice as much as we can. It'll be fun though. I hope you guys are there to help support. Dun, 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 dun. Looks like his competition is running from the 17th until the 21st, I think it said. So it's like a four-day competition. Do 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 do. So hopefully we get this. I just want to be done with this. Honestly, I I, I screwed it up the first time, epically, and now I'm just regretting my life decisions. Uh, I did mention yesterday I am going to continue doing the the shiny hunt on my spare time as much as possible without impeding anything uh, so we might be like 200 maybe 300 checks in later you and me both dude yeah sean like i just i want to try to get it done as soon as possible i know you do dude you're over odds i can't believe how much you're over odds That's crazy. Dude, if you reach 5,000, my mind will be blown. 
Anthony, did you shiny check any of the legendaries or did you just give up? Curious. Looking like it's going over five thousand. I really hope not, dude. I am, dude. I feel so bad for you. Ooh. I can't believe that. Honestly. I ser I would have guessed you got it like 2,000 checks ago. Obviously not, but like... It is a... Man. I, I don't even know how to follow up with that. Like, <laughs> it's just brutal. I'm sorry. Are you at work right now, Sean? Or are you actually home? Are you shiny checking? as we speak. I do like this mix. I'm assuming that's yes to everything I just asked. All right, all right. Well, Please don't go over 5,000. I don't need you to go Super Saiyan on me. We're both going till midnight. Ooh, I can't. I have plans tonight. I am going till about probably six if I had to guess. So I got like three hours in me. Maybe a little longer. I don't know. We'll see. I would, I'd say I'd like to go till midnight, but honestly, I get so bored of doing these at times. I get all drowsy. This is like my medicine. And I don't like being like that all the time. So that's why I want to be done with the resets. I get too head naughty. I like being active as much as possible. But yeah, we need to do it as much. I think I need to play more during the day, if possible. The night's are just brutal for me, especially since I wake up at 6 a.m., 6.30, depending on the day, and hit snooze. I don't hit snooze. You hit snooze. Thirty-nine. How's the audio on the music? Can uh, anyone tell me? Good, bad? There was a complaint on it the other day, so I just wanted to double check because I did mess with something. Yeah, late nights are rough for me. Yeah, see, it's starting to become that way for me, especially with waking up so early. But I've been doing it since the pandemic now. Like, I just, I can't stop waking up early. Even on weekends when I sleep in, it's 8 o'clock. 8.30 was the longest I slept in the other day. And I woke up thinking I was late. It like freaked me out. Yeah, I don't like waking up like that either. Who does? Yeah, because you go to bed pretty early. Well, I wouldn't say early, early, but like 9, 10-ish, depending on the day. 11, I've seen you go to bed as well. But you, you, I'd say early compared to, I try to go to bed around midnight. Like six hours is usually what I need. Uh, 
don't oh, know. How many, how much sleep do you guys try to get a night? Like, what's your average hours of sleep? Toaster's probably got a, a wonky sleep schedule, I want to say, but at the same time, it's probably consistent because of the kids. Like, he can get them to bed early. They don't wake up until early. So I don't, like, maybe he has a more consistent sleep schedule than I'm thinking. It's just during the day, it's hectic because of the kids. Um, not that they're bad or anything, just the kids. The difference between them being awake and not awake is a huge difference. <laughs> Same with my brother, actually. I'm curious, Anthony, what's your, like, sleep schedule, or how many hours are you sleeping nowadays? With my nephew. I'm curious. Am I the only one with a really messed up sleep schedule? Yes, I am. All right. All right, all right, all right. We're getting the shiny today. Hopefully. Jesus. I'm honestly over it. Especially since if you add our first encounter where we did get it and I screwed it up and I epically failed, which you can go see on my YouTube. It's Stefan L-O-V-E-619. Uh, 1,716 checks. We are now at 3,460 checks total between the first and now second. So, caca. We just, we need to get it, man. It's not as bad as Sean. We definitely have gotten one, so like it's definitely not as bad as Sean. It'd be mighty convenient if we can get it right now. Mighty convenient. Uh, Cheddar, did you get your legendaries already? Did you get your three lake spirits specifically? I forgot that the adult should have done something and I forgot. Didn't plan well. My friends didn't plan well. Not shiny, shiny. We need that shiny, shiny. Give us that shiny, shiny.
It wasn't shiny. Come on. Dun, dun, dun. Come on now. This isn't even like my favorite shiny in the world. I just I went and get it for the deck entry. That's it. That's it. And we can do it. Pokemon spawning, we don't care. We want this Pokemon. Let's go. Seventeen fifty. Oh, we don't reach two thousand. That's my hope. I I hope we don't reach four thousand. 770. This is so brutal. I feel bad. But it is what it is. All I can do is support my friend and tell him that he is a beast. Shiny checks in while well, we got an opportunity. Normally, I try to plan like some event coming up, but I, I do not have the means at this moment. We are kind of stretched thin until some things come in. Uh, I do want to look into getting more cards. We actually have got now our complete set of celebrations. I have the Xerneas card coming in on a trade, uh, so I have the I'm going to have my complete celebration set done and we'll show that off on stream once i do get that very well worth it we also still have and these are two of my favorites the extra oops ah we'll soon check real quick and i'll adjust my mic and stop leaning back like i'm half cat boom, boom. we still have the extra Shining Carp, 25th anniversary card, which is gorgeous. Love it. And we still have an extra copy of the Gold Star Umbreon, 25th anniversary card, which again, sweet. Looking at probably going to sell those or trade them to try to get some more, um, I thought I, I just stopped pressing buttons, to try to get more, um, or product to open up. Um, I'm really happy I could use a half day today, kind of cut out a little bit early. Use some PTO. But yeah, just kind of nice, easy mellow stream trying to get our shiny that we need to do so we are able to participate in the streamer contest. Uh, again, I think it would be a lot of fun. I think we'd be able to to maybe gain at least like a few viewers. I don't care if we gain two, one even. One is better than zero. And new eyes on the product always help. I... So just do our best. Let's get this shiny. Let's put in the work and go from there. Hope everyone's having a great day though. Honestly, not too bad. Can't really complain. It is cold as fuck, though. I will say that. It is absolutely cold.
0 for 4,800. Sean. <sighs> that is rough. Dude, I can't imagine. Maybe you've gotten it and reset it? No, I'm joking. You would know. Boom. Let's see. get back into my comfortable groove over here. Dun, dun, dun. I like this jam. Oh, yeah. I got to bring up the Twitter poll results. We finally got our answer on that. And because I said I was tiebreaker, I think that comes into uh, play here. Unacceptable! <laughs> Your count is unacceptable? So, boom, where's the web? Yeah, I agree. So, if you look at the Twitter poll, it's a tie between Final Fantasy and Pokemon Gen, and because of our conversation about the Pokemon Gen issues running on my computer, uh, we are going to start with the Final Fantasies, and hopefully by the end of it, we'll have the means to be able to uh, run all the Pokemon games on the emulator. Because I know I can do at least three or four of the generations, that's proven, but I think once we get past that, it's going to start running so bad while we stream that it's not going to operate properly, and that's my biggest fear. So I don't want to start it and it not work, and Pokemon's a franchise we can always hop right into. Like, we're not going to be done with this diamond at all. We're not going to be done... Uh, with Arceus when that comes out, depending on how the gameplay revolves and what there is to do. So we are going to still have two game series. This is only going to be a Thursday game night. So we're going to do a throwback Thursday, and we're going to start off with Final Fantasies, 7 through 15, not including the onlines. And we'll stream every Thursday night with that. So that'll be fun. Uh, if you've never played the Final Fantasies, it's one of my favorite games ever. Game series, actually. I should rephrase that. 7, 8, 9, 10 were all phenomenal games, in my opinion. If you made me rank them, I'm going to say 7, 9, 10, 8. And, 10, and 8's really good. Just 8's misunderstood so badly. It takes you like two or three playthroughs to actually understand what the fuck is going on. Like it is not only a mind fuck, but like the power set, the scaling and the way you get magic and everything just doesn't make sense. It's a different style of play. You can technically get the, char the main character's ultimate weapon before doing the first mission of the game, which is the very like first 10 minutes. It literally tells you to go outside and then go do it. Uh, and then you choose a timeline of how fast to beat it. 
and it's fighting Ifrit. So you can literally get his ultimate weapon before beating Ifrit. All you gotta do is go play cards for like 12 hours. It was a card game in it. It's crazy. Eight and nine both have card games as side quests. Which nines is okay. Kind of sucks because it's hard to understand that gameplay. It doesn't make sense. And eights is uh, easy to understand, but they have the most fucked up added rules. And what I mean by that is like, uh, they have like same plus, which means it's like, they lay down a card that has the same number as any of the ones they lay it next to based on its number grid it'll flip the card even if it doesn't beat it in any way like it's it's a weird rule combination uh they also do like elemental the plus negatives uh there's a bunch of other rules crimson what up my guy how are you today i hope you're doing wonderful Just got home from work. How about yourself? Doing great, actually. Decided to take a half day. It was super slow at work. Didn't really want to be there. There was nothing to do. So I was like, I'll dip. I'm okay with that. I should have got a little more adulting done. But I came home thinking I was going to be in a rush tonight. And then that changed. Uh, I was going to go out with a bunch of people. And now it's changed to one person, which is fine by me. Adulting is seriously overrated. I would 100% agree, but sometimes you just need to do it. I need to go pay my phone bill, specifically. And I need to pay my car bill, which I could just do right after the stream. I just forgot to do it. And it's not late or anything. I just forgot to do it. So, got to do those two things. Also need to like buy groceries. I should probably clean up a little bit more. But I wanted to stream as fast as possible. Don't you hate the necessary of money? Oh my God, yes. But at the same time, I love it. I heard a line once before. It was like, uh, I love money. Money is fucking evil though. But money also makes the world go round. And <laughs> I need that shit. <laughs> I thought that was one of the funniest lines I've ever heard. I was like, damn, that's good. Money is evil and it does make the world go round. Everything's reliant on money nowadays. And that's unfortunate. See, I've never been one to be like, man, I want to be a really rich one day, but I recognize that money is the means to the things I enjoy doing. Uh, I, re I was that guy when I was younger. I was like, oh, I want to be rich. But it, I had no concept of how to do it besides sports. And then, like, I just, I fell out of love with playing because of how much I was forced into it. And then, like, I hated school, so, like, I, it was just, I'm going to work hard. So, I don't like working my life away anymore, though. That's my issue. I like working so I'm able to pay my bills and do what I need to do. I don't want to work my life away. I'm going to do this check and go grab a drink real quick. That's not a shiny. All right, we'll be right back. Grab a drink. Be up less than a minute. Oh.
called that shit. Called it. So yeah, we have Throwback Thursday starting mid February, about second week after Arceus. Probably, yeah, let's say second week is a safe bet. And that'll be a series going forward from now on permanently. Throwback Thursday. Who's pumped for Seal? I forgot it was Pokemon Go Community Day. I'm not even gonna lie. I, I seriously did. I made plans. I might do like an hour, maybe two, but I don't know. We'll see. Probably play from home. I did get Johto Day off, though. I will not give Niantic money in any way, shape, or form. So I'm not playing that event. They don't deserve my money. Yeah, we had the sock. Yep, but I, I don't criticize by any means. If you want to pay them, by all, go ahead and pay for the event. I'm just one of the believers uh, still, like, you shouldn't have to pay for it. Yeah, whatever brings you joy. Exactly. No judgments. Just my opinion is uh, we should still have the hashtag hear us Niantic movement going. Because nothing has changed. We just went back to giving them money. Well, most people. And again, I don't judge. That's what you want to do and you're having fun with the game? Who am I to judge you? I did it for years. I enjoyed my time playing the game and because I didn't really buy any other new games and that was my form of entertainment. I had no problem giving it money. And I definitely did. You don't think they're going to listen to those of focus groups they said they were going... No, absolutely not. We also were told we were going to get updates and the only updates we got were dev diaries. Oh, I've been deep into Final Fantasy XIV lately. I actually own all of them except for the last expansion. Uh, but I really barely played. I got on to play with a friend, and I didn't get too into it. I, I definitely should probably give it another chance with how big it's gotten. Um, but, Crimson, we're actually doing... I just mentioned it... Um, Final Fantasy uh, 15, the non-online ones. So that means 7, 8, 9, 10, 12. I've never played 12 through. Uh, heck, I, I don't know shit about 12. But uh, we'll figure it out, I guess. And we'll give it a shot. But uh, 12, and 12, 13, and 15. And we're also going to do the... Final Fantasy 7 Remake. I don't know if we'll do 10-2. I don't think so. I'm not a huge fan. I'm interested to play 7 because I've never played those. Or like 10, 10-2. 10 I literally... <laughs> Alright, maybe I'll play 10-2 then. I've beat it once. Like, I've played 10-2 and beat it. I just wasn't a fan of it when I was a kid. Maybe I'll appreciate it more as an adult. You never know. So, that can definitely be an option. Uh, I do own it. That's not an issue. Um... And then, uh, I don't know if we'll do 13-2 and 13-3. And those are the Final Fantasies. Uh, I think those just go off the rails. I think we'll just keep it with the 13. You know what I mean?
My buddy loves 10 and 10 too. 10 is good. I was saying earlier that uh, 7, 8, 9, and 10 are easily my favorites. And if you're like putting a gun to my head and you're making me choose, I'm going to say 7, 9, 10, 8. And don't get me wrong, 8 is really good. It's just so misunderstood. And 10 is really good too. It's just 9 and 7 hold special places in my heart. Especially 10. Or I'm sorry, especially 7. Uh, 9 is really good. A lot of people would argue it's the best. And I would be hard-pressed to tell them no. Because I can totally see why. It's adorable in every way. It's got the old school like Final Fantasy feels. Uh, it's got a growth system that's unique and easy to learn. Um, but yeah, I think it's going to be a lot of fun. We're going to play those through. I think I've played one, maybe two, three, and parts of the 13 trilogy. I want to pick up the Pixel remasters at some point. Oh, yeah, I actually just saw something on the Pixel Remasters the other day. I didn't even know they were doing that. Um, I'll ha have to catch the streams if I'm that busy. Definitely. Right there, I don't know why it does that. Uh, or you could always go to the YouTube channel and you can watch the VOD uploads that I throw up there or the clips I throw up. Uh, and I will... Actually, I need to create thumbnails for that now. Sorry, I'm hijacking your chat. No, you're absolutely fine. I enjoy talking to everyone in chat. Anyone that hops in here, I enjoy speaking to. So, like, I appreciate it. Just hop on in. Let's have a conversation. Everybody else can hop on in, too. Like, honestly, I'll talk about anything. I think you guys have already kind of gathered that by this point. <laughs> But yeah, uh, I, I really enjoy the Final Fantasy games. They're some of my favorites of all time. So we're going to be playing that series next. Uh, and then we'll kind of go from there. We might even might have to do like a, a Witcher. If you decide to get back into 14, let me know. We could run some stuff. Yeah, I could also get uh, Queen Curiosity who was in here. Uh, one of the homegirls. One of the followers as well as the uh, subscribers she also plays she was the one that tried to get me into it initially it's just it, it was very intense to start and to start and to play by yourself after you started was very for me it was difficult because i just it was like well i don't know where to go or what to do and they're like well go to this city and i'm like oh okay how do i figure that out like, I know she explained a lot when I first played, and she was very good at it. Do not get me wrong. There's just, there was so much, it was hard to remember everything I needed to, where to go, what to do. Like, it just, she's like, what do you want to do? I was like, I want to play the game. Can I kill something? Can I level up? But yeah, it would be interesting to play again. It's a paid subscription service though, right? No. And there's still like hour long lobby queues, right? Oh, it's a lot to take in for sure. I've always low key hated the subscription model for games and I struggle with the MMOs uh, unless I have people I'm playing with. See, yeah, that, that's what gets me as well. I don't like buying a game and then having to pay a monthly subscription service. It bugs the fuck out of me. It's like buying a fighting game and getting four characters and having to buy every individual character after that or buying DLC. Like, it just... You obviously didn't put out the game with its full intent at that point, you know? But the story alone is almost enough to grab me for a single player. Uh, see, and I don't even know where to start with that. I didn't even know there was a single player on it, technically. I thought it was all online. I'm super confused. I feel I like use to hate... Paying for Xbox Live. I haven't paid for Xbox Live in like three years. I haven't been playing online on my Xbox. So I just stopped paying for it. I was like 15 years or 14 years on my account. And I just stopped paying for it. Because I'm on it every day. But like I don't play online every day. I, don't, I barely ever play online. Most of my games are single player nowadays. I mean, 
playing solo, not necessarily single player per se. Yeah, see, I'm playing single player or solo games 90% of the time I feel nowadays. I used to play Call of Duty, used to. Uh, I played most of those first person shooters. I'm not a huge fan. I'll play them, but I'm just, I don't understand how some people can see somebody from like a million miles away and just hit some of them shots. Like I had a friend that was the most clutch motherfucker on the planet. And I just, I never understood how he could move like he moved and made it work, you know? Uh, if you focus on the main scenario quest, the job class quest, it helps to digest it in a, a little bit better. Okay. Okay, yeah, I, I tried playing it a few times. I think I played like an hour or two by myself, just trying to go... I don't remember what I did, actually. I think I was just trying to figure everything out again after she showed me the one time. I don't think I was able to pick it up until like the next week, unfortunately. But yeah, she had me buy all of it. And I don't, want to say, I don't want to say like she made me. I decided to do it. It wasn't like a forced decision by any means. And I love Final Fantasy. So like it was like a win-win scenario, especially since me and her played Warframe together. She was actually one of the clans. She's one of the people and actually the only other person I started the clan with, and we ended up having a pretty big clan, it was pretty dope, a lot of good people, it was fun. And hold off on things like alt, jobs, crafting, at least that's what I have, what people recommended for me. Okay, maybe I will, I don't know, I don't like paying a monthly service on a game once I paid for it, so we'll figure it out. Maybe once I get through all the Final Fantasy series, we'll go from there and try it. Might even play Tactics. I don't know. I really like Tactics. And there's a rumor that a remastered version is coming out this year. So if that does happen, Final Fantasy Tactics, we'll probably be playing that on stream. I love the Final Fantasy games. Honestly. Oh, I need to take that off my but I'll do that after stream. Sure. Big deal. RPGs will always be my favorite genre. I really need to try Chrono Trigger at some point. Same. I own it. Yes, I own it. Uh, bought it digitally on the PlayStation 3 store. I think they're gonna stop selling stuff on that soon, so, or they already have. Um, never played it. Every time I bought a hard copy, the disc was always so messed up, it never worked. So I'd get like a half an hour into it and screw up, or get like 10 minutes into it and it'd be screwed up, or an hour and a half into it and it wouldn't read. I'm a huge RPG fan. There's a, a few that I really didn't get into, like Star Ocean, didn't get into it. I also didn't get into uh, Xeno Saga? No, Xeno... Gears? No. Oh. Xenoblade. With the, the robot chick, the mechanized robot chick. Am I wrong? Yeah, yeah, I did not enjoy that. Uh, it started off okay. It reminded me of Grandia in a way. And I was like, okay, this, this could be good. Because uh, I played the PS2 version. I think it was the first Xenoblade. Uh, and I got to where the city was on fire. And you were doing the hurdles across all the debris and stuff. Where you really didn't have to do anything. But it's just, it wasn't good in my opinion. That's where it lost me. Right there. I remember. If you want a really good RPG style game. Have you ever played Bravely Default? Super solid game. I have not played Bravely Default. What is Bravely Default? Because someone tried to get me to, someone really recommended uh, Tales of Asperia to me, and I got like two hours into it and just could not get into the fighting style. There was like no real explanation to it either, so that did not help me.
It was for Nintendo DS, 3DS. I know. See, I didn't play uh, any RPGs on there besides Pokemon uh, and the Zelda remakes. And I saw there's now one on Steam. Okay. Also, Golden Sun, amazing game. Yeah, I don't like playing RPGs on my small screens. That, it bugs me. That's why I'm playing my Switch on my TV. Like, it, it honestly bugs me to play on a small screen. It's so like, I rarely, I think I've used my mobile mode like three or four times total since owning my Switch. I've used it more letting other people play it like that than I have. So, emulator, maybe, but I do have, like, my old Dia. I'd much rather play on that, but I don't want to pay $400 to get a, a, a capture card that works with it, so we're able to use it on stream. That kind of bugs me. And for the emulator without getting any copyright strikes or anything like that. Um, uh, <laughs> us to use the emulator versions of anything technically, we actually, I actually have to own a physical copy. If I don't actually own a physical copy, they can technically give me copyright strikes and take my channel. It's actually part of uh, the contract. So like if push came to shove, they could really just cancel the channel. If I use anything that's on an emulator and I don't physically own a copy of it. So like I could do Breath of the Wild because I own a copy of it, I could do most of the Poke almost all the Pokemon games. I do not own Sun and Moon, so I would need to go out and buy Sun and Moon just so we could emulate it when it was time. That was one of the weirdest things I've ever found out, like looking online. Like you actually have to own a copy of it to legally emulate it on Twitch, to be more specific. It's part of the contract I signed as a streamer or an affiliate of Twitch. Otherwise, I wouldn't be able to use emulated stuff, technically. <sighs> Sean, 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 Sean. I want to hear you tell me you got a shiny new seat today, my man. It's gonna bug me if you don't. I also need to try Fire Emblem. I've never played the Fire Emblems. Yeah, that would be nice. I I envisioned you saying it exactly like that. Yeah, that would be nice. Have you ever played a Fire Emblem series? Better yet, have you ever played any of the Final Fantasies yourself and the Fire Emblem series? Obviously not together. Because isn't Fire Emblem done by Square Enix? I haven't played any Final B -E -E Fire Emblem, but I hear good things. Okay, Fire Emblem. I was like, F E. Yeah, I've heard good things too. I've never committed to playing them. I know they're strategy 
fighting games essentially where you like choose a squad and fight with them I don't know how it works exactly I know each one's a little bit different Get that shiny You see Shine Do 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 Get that shiny You see Shine I'm doing the robot. Oh, that was a big ass robot. Hey, don't call me fat. Don't think that'd be funny. Just tell me I'm beautiful. Has anyone played any of the Final Fantasies, or is it just like me? Am I just abnormally... Well, no, I know a ton of people that love them growing up. I can't say it's just me. Might be a generational thing. Because that transition to Final Fantasy VII on the PlayStation when I was younger, I didn't even understand it at first. Like, it just blew my mind. I watched a friend play. That's literally how I got into it. And then I finally got it for Christmas. And, yeah... Eight was so difficult, so good though. Like without a strategy guide book to explain things, I did not understand it, honestly. It was one of the more difficult games I've played through. It took a long time for me to go from like childhood brain to adult brain and be like, duh, this is how this works. And I'm gonna explain it once we get to it, but it is not an easy thing actually. Like it's kind of a pain in the ass to do the equipping in A. It's easy, but it's a pain in the ass at the same time. Like, yeah, I, I know it doesn't make sense, but it will once we get to it. Nine, there's only one thing that's really a pain in the ass in that, and we're not doing it. It's that simple. I have to do a speed run in 12 hours and get to a, the end point of disc four, the end of the game, essentially and meet Hades and have him give us an item. And it's the only way you can get that item in the entire game. And you have to defeat some major ass shit along the way. And just speed run the whole thing. If you do it right, you're given no more than like 20 minutes spare time to get there. So like you have a 20 minute leniency. And that's not including cutscenes. So you gotta skip every single cutscene cutscene you also have to have everything well it's a lot easier sped up nowadays but yeah it's kind of crazy did i double click that just now i think i did not sure uh but we won't be doing that that's not something we'll be doing we will be beating the game and getting everything else but that that's a for sure we'll play 10 i don't know if we'll complete the sphere grid if you've ever played 10, you'll know what I'm talking about. If not, we'll go from there. Again, 12 I've never played before. Uh, I take that back. I've played 
played like an hour or two. I wasn't a fan. I did not enjoy it, so I stopped playing there. Uh, I was also very dumb and young, so my opinion of it can very well change. Um, so I will give it another chance, and we'll kind of see how it goes. Again, only played like an hour or two of that. But 13 we'll play, beat that. 15 we will also play, I'll beat that. Uh, 15 is a lot more free reign compared to everything else. It'll be fun. It'll be our throwback Thursdays. Every Thursday. And maybe Saturday, because I think I'm going to change Saturdays to whatever I want Saturdays. And Sunday will be uh, Community Day Sunday, whatever you guys want to see me play. Or whatever you want to play with me that it is available of my means at that time. Oops. And then Monday, we're going to try to pick back up the Breath of the Wild speedruns. Tuesday, we'll probably end up doing either Diamond or Arceus. And Friday will be Diamond or Arceus. Wow, we got our schedule made out. I like it. I like it. Go back Thursday. Right now we're going to have to figure out if we do Final Fantasy VII. Do we do the remake immediately? Yeah, we should do the remake immediately afterwards because it'll be fresh in everyone's heads. So, I played it on the Xbox or the PlayStation? That's the question. PlayStation's more natural. I have those achievements. We'll do it on the Xbox! Yes, I'm a side achievement whore when I do play games. I love getting goals done. Makes my makes my playthrough a little bit more enjoyable. If I was to hop on the PlayStation version, there's one achievement in Final Fantasy VII I still have not done. Because it is goddamn time consuming like a motherfucker. Which is uh, get 99,999... Wait, I'm sorry. 999,999,999 gil, which is money in Final Fantasy. It's literally breaking the money counter. Might even go to the billion. I think it's the billion. Uh, and just... It is just a pain in the ass. The best way to get money is to earn a couple items and some XP from some monsters that level up these materials. Materials how you do moves. And you sell them off at max price. And every time you max one out, you get a new one. And every time you sell one, it's 1.4 million. And unfortunately, that's the easiest way to get money by far. It's kind of unfortunate. It is a pain in the ass. I'm still doing it on my PlayStation version, but I, I barely go back and play it and try and do it. I get so annoyed with it. It's just like, it's so tedious. I think I've sold like 75 alls already. Adios, what are the O's? Oh, that was 1800. Slowly notice that. 1800! Yay! We're. Catching up to Sean? Yay? Question mark? Ooh. I say we need some hype, but hype's not going to do it. No, because I'm playing right now, too. No, I'm catching up to you, Sean. Don't you lie. 
I'm like 100 behind you. What are you talking about, man? You're only at 1,900 checks. 4850. It's blasphemy. Hey, guess what? Fun fact, not shiny. Alright, so it looks like stream will be cutting off around 5. So we got about 40 minutes or so. Actually, no, it'll be a little bit longer, maybe. It won't be right away. We'll be on for a little bit longer than 5, for sure. I want at least, oh, oh, if I can get to 2,000 checks at least today, that would be prime. That would be prime, especially while I'm trying to figure out what's going on. Give it a click, thank you. I'm a beast! Dun, dun, dun. We need to do this. Hmm. I like that name, that's a cool name. Hmm. Is it a bot? Interesting. Just thinking about that. I really need a haircut. Probably need to trim everything. Could always use a beard trim. Never a complete shave, just a beard trim. I don't like being clean shaven. Plus, it's cold. I need my beard for warmth. Oh, fair. Cold face at work. Oh, it'd be the worst being outside all day. Oh, it's rough. It is cold as fuck outside. I don't know what the temp was when I left work, but cold as a feck. That's like, that's a temperature reading, right? That's a perfect temperature reading. Dun, 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 dun. Sean, how cold is it down in Pueblo right now? Or is it even cold? Do you guys have sun? Is it snowing? Like it is over here, or like it was. I don't know if it still is. I can't tell right now. I'm indoors. Yeah, 
And all my blinds are closed. Oh, that's rough. Oh, no, don't be stupid. I was almost stupid. Sorry, got a message. 39 and windy as fuck. So you don't even have rain or snow? Dog. Oh, it's rough. What is it actually right here right now? Let me see what my weather report is saying. Oh, it's 37. Okay. With, with snow flurries. And the snow is going to end around 8 p.m. I don't know how bad it is. I haven't looked outside in like... Two and a half hours, and I've been on stream for well, an hour and 15 minutes of that, so literally half of the time I've been here. Took me an hour to throw away a couple things and to get ready for stream, essentially. I also got stuck watching a podcast. Yes, watching a podcast. Them, they actually put out a video of their podcast. I'm not a huge fan of Amaranth, but she was on... Ludwig's podcast. I didn't even know he had one until today. The Yard with uh, stands and uh, Slime and I don't know the other guy, to be honest. Slime I like the most out of them, honestly. Slime and Ludwig. Uh, but they had Amaranth on and they were just asking her questions about like her net worth and all that kind of stuff. And I thought that was kind of interesting. Just her money views and how she's making the money and how she's growing on the platform and all the things she's doing, and I'm like, okay, that's interesting. I'm okay. With, I'm listening to that. So, thought that was kind of cool. I like learning from other people. Other people have better ideas than me at times, and I will fully admit that. And I am one to adapt and learn. Uh, I am never one to turn down an idea. I'm not going to be doing hot tub streams anytime soon. But... I will definitely take her business model ideas that she had in there and kind of apply. I'm actually, I'm going to pop up. We'll see what the weather's like right after this. And I did click. Okay, cool. Okay. More snow than I thought. There's uh, at least like two to three inches, if I had to guess. I'm going to do this check and run to the bathroom real quick while it loads up the next one after this check.
Moppy. Thanks for being patient. Had to go. Not like a little bit like bad all of a sudden. It's always the worst. They're just like, ooh, that hit me like a ton of bricks. Got a dip. Time to play some Monster Hunter Rise. That's the Nintendo Switch version? Crimson, that's the Switch version, right? Originally on Switch, just came out on PC. Is there cross-platform play? <coughs> Community Day Sunday. <coughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. That's this deep cough back of my throat. <laughs> I wonder what that was about. Weird. It came, came out of nowhere. It says deep cough. A little violent there. I need to take that message off. It will bother me until I do. Who, 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 who need to make some nails now? Ooh, shit. That's some oh, fuck. I'm never doing that this week, guys. I gotta get better at making thumbnails. We gotta make them for Throwback Thursdays. out everything on Final Fantasies too. It'd be a good refresher. Some of the stories are convoluted though. I will say that. I think I could play six if I wanted. I believe I have the means to do six, but maybe two I know nothing about. Which I could get away with. It's just I know six is brutal as fuck. Especially if you don't know what to do, because you can miss characters very easily, you miss side quests. You fight one wrong enemy, it'll wipe your entire team. I watched a speed run of it the other day, just to kind of see what I'd be dealing with. Dude beats it in just under seven hours, if I'm not mistaken. He runs from 85% of the battles and just... I don't know how he makes it work, honestly. I have no idea how he made it work. Like, he was so quick with his menuing. He was also menuing while fighting. So he was always constantly moving something in the menu bar, moving it around to readjust his inventory. Uh, it was kind of crazy. He literally didn't look at anything for more than like a second. Ever played Monster Hunter? My buddy's got me into World a couple years ago. Yeah, I played World with my brother, uh, brothers, and a couple of his friends. I really got into Monster Hunter World. I enjoyed it a lot. I played most of it. I did not get the DLCs though. Uh, but there's at a time and point where that game runs its course, you know what I mean? Like, I I barely beat this one and then kind of just like stopped playing. But if I remember right, Pokemon Snap came out right afterwards, and then a couple. 
So fun, what's your weapon style? I'll play dual blades. I do like the dual blades. I didn't like the long sword when I first started. I tried that. I wasn't a huge fan. I do want to try to get into the insect glaive eventually. Early click. But I do enjoy Monster Rant or uh, Monster Hunter. I forgot it was Pokemon Go Community Day this Sunday. Yeah, I'm most likely playing for home. 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 Good thing I have a max bag right now. What weapons do you use, Crimson? Trying to like close it early. Yeah, it's a lot more fun with people. Definitely. I do enjoy playing Monster Hunter. I was dual blades for world. I'm trying to take Glaive and Rise. There it is. Me and you seem to have the same mentality at that point. <laughs> that's exactly what I <laughs> Yeah, that's funny. That's really funny. There's a lot of details in uh, Monster Hunter that I thought were really cool. Uh, World was my first one. Definitely was my first one. And I did enjoy it. I did not fight the Final Fantasy Behemoth, though. I am kind of disappointed in that. Yeah, my brother... And a couple of his buddies really like encouraged me to play it with them. I really had no loss in playing it with them. Um, me and my brother game share, so he bought it digitally, so I got it for free. So like I had no loss. So I I, did, I played. I enjoyed it. It was fun. I'm glad I committed to it. But it was I hated it by myself. I enjoy it with people, kind of thing. You know what I mean? Oh, I might not be able to play community in day. I, I might have to get online. God damn it. I'll fix that. The grind for materials can be a lot. That's a fact. Jack. I'll have to call him. I have to call my brother. Me and him family share on Nintendo and pay for the uh, membership between the two of us. Oh yeah, the grind for materials and you never get what you quite want half the time. Yeah, the material grind in Monster Hunter is brutal. But it's going to be a fun community today game. I like it. I'm down to play it. I will attempt to get my membership tonight or tomorrow. Again, share with the brother. And make sure he's cool with it. If he's not, just get a solo plan for 20 bucks. Oh no, they changed the pricing. God damn it. That's why I didn't do it, if I remember right now. But I think it's like 80 bucks now for the family plan. Dun, 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 dun. We need a shiny. We need some shiny hype. We need some some love, some some grind, some passion. But I'm down to play some Monster Hunter. I'm sure I could actually get 
him to play as well. I could probably get the third brother, or the second brother, my actual closest brother, middle brother, to play with us as well. Murdero and Cheddar Cheese, both in the stream at times. Uh, I bet I can get both to play. And we can have a squad. Have you beaten it, or are you just starting? fun game. I was surprised how much fun I had with it, actually. We've got a good stream schedule coming up in February. Please, where's my notepad? My handy dandy notepad. That's right, I blues clues to you guys. That's right, I like making notes. I'm old school. I also gonna remember shit all the time. I don't have a photogenic memory. I don't, I'm not a mind reader. I'm not perfect. Well, that's unfortunate. Sorry, making a couple notes about scheduling going forward. Make sure we're I'm 100% on on point. Dun, 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 dun. So yeah, we're gonna go forward one day off a week. We'll be streaming six days a week somehow, some way. Just trying to grow. And grow by good content, not being a twat. Uh, Pokemon RCS. I already forgot what was Friday. Oh no. I already messed this up. Already messed this up. It's all good. Go back. Thursdays. Final Fantasy series. And then Pokemon Arceus on Fridays. There we go. I can't even write like this. It's hard to write. Holding up, it's kind of feels stupid. Especially since it looks so sloppy and nasty. Excuse me. I wrote Thursday for the Friday event. God damn it, Stephen. I am special. 
I'm not being made fun of for this. Surprise, you guys aren't reading me. There you go. Zelda, Diamond, Off, Throwback Thursday, Arceus, whatever the hell I want, Community Day Sunday. I wouldn't be surprised if whatever the hell I want turned into if wanted to play a little bit more Final Fantasy and speeding up those series. Or Shiny Hunts. Especially if Arceus has shiny hunts. We have not 100% have confirmation on that. But that could be interesting in that game. Do we see him in the overworld? What happens? So, I'm curious to see that. Or to know what happens there. I just thought... I should have messaged somebody and told them to be safe, and... I should have said that sooner. Now I feel stupid. Stupid. It's okay. It's alright. It'll be okay. We got this. We got this. Does anyone have any... Oh, we forgot to do our stream prediction. Crap. Doing it now. We need it today. We want it today. Stream prediction is up. Am I getting a shiny? This stream, yes or no. Use your channel points. What do you got? What do you think? What is happening? Somebody's betting no on me. 
the cruelty in the people's eyes. You just shut me down. Just crushing my soul. Have no faith. Ye of little faith. I do have to go outside here in like the next 20, 15, 20 minutes to go grab something. So I will throw up a Be Right Back banner and just keep the music flowing while I'm gone. But I will be right back. Be no longer than five minutes. Just an FYI. Well, maybe a, maybe like eight minutes. It just all really depends on delivery at the front, like how that goes, you know what I mean? So I do have to go grab that. And actually check my mail to see if my Xerneas trade came in. So I will take a five minute break when I have to go check that door. Yeah, I love our music on streams, honestly. We had some good music choices. Y'all helped it. Y'all knocked it out of the park. And honestly, I think I've already mentioned this before, but like I've been watching a lot of YouTubers videos. I always try to watch more stuff. I'm just trying to get better. Uh, but I hear the same songs in the background on most of them, and I just start laughing. I'm like, yeah, we got, all right, we got the music down. We're good on the music front for now. So I'm just like, all right, I know it's, I can use it. I know it's free. I know no copyright strikes. That's key. Key. We don't want to play that game. I do not want anything from Starbucks. Sorry, someone's asking me if I want something from Starbucks. I do not. Never. The answer is never. But thank you for asking. I'm not a Starbucks fan. I don't like coffee or tea or energy drinks. So if I got anything, it'd be a hot chocolate or something, which I'm not going to buy like a $6 hot chocolate from Starbucks. You know what I mean? I don't like I don't judge anybody by any means. It's just, I think people are too reliant on it. I might need it nowadays just because I'm head nodding so much. But like, I just don't like the taste. I hate it. One of the young guys that works with me, I just saw him today, he, he drinks his coffee black, just straight black, no sugar, no nothing.
really quick. We almost, almost, we're never going to get it. We're not, we're going to get it. We don't have as bad luck as Sean. Come on. I'm sorry, Sean. So sorry to say it. Oh, my buddy. I'm so sorry. Early click. So yeah, if you didn't know, you can use your channel points for your prediction. Whether I'm going to get a shiny on this stream, yes or no. Uh, it should be above in the stream chat. Just scroll in there. You can just select it, vote some channel points, and win or lose. It's been a fun thing. We do it every stream. Goes up for a half an hour. You guys have roughly 20 minutes left to find a guess. Uh, it's a fun little prediction game, though. You get more free channel points this way. You can also lose channel points. Gambling is gambling is gambling is gambling. Early click again. I am early clicking. I need to pull away. Early click. Early click. We'll start this for that. That came out of nowhere. Okay. Come on, 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 
early click. Ah, King just went live. I respect King. Good player. Grinder turned into a PvP player. And Pokemon Go, to be specific. I respect the man. He's got a he's got a grind on his shoulders. Like he plays. They measured the first metric of uh, a good player based on his stats and stuff at the beginning. That's why all the like, leaderboards are called king points, or they were back in the day. Cool. Do, 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 do. 1850, we didn't get it. 1851, though. 1851, though. Like, this is the one. The one and the only. The shiny Azel that we are still resetting for. Because mm -hmm. that's what I was saying from the beginning. We're still resetting for the shiny as well. There's no implication that that was going to be the shiny. National Dex is easy to get. Oh, for 4,900. Sean, I am so sorry. Between the two of us, we are... We are one for 8,478, or 68, sorry. One for seventy four sixty eight between the two of us. It's a lot, my man. Sweatshirt, real quick, let us know. Alright guys, I'm going to do this check and then I got to go to the front door like I was saying. So I'll be on the standby for about five, six minutes and I'll be right back. So we'll do the check and then we'll go to 
BRB screen and you guys can jam out for a little bit with some music. All right. Bear with me. I appreciate you being here. I'll turn up the tunes as well. Not shiny. All right, BRB.
Yo, we are back. Sorry with the delay. Uh, like I said, had to run outside real quick. Uh, wanted to be polite. That's the way I was taught. So, welcome to the stream. Welcome back. Welcome me. Uh, welcome to everybody. Uh, we also checked the mail real quick. And I think I have that card I was talking about. For whatever reason, it's in like the biggest case in the world. I just don't understand it. It's a, it's a Pokemon card. It's a single Pokemon card. So we're going to open this up real quick, see what we got. Shit. They must have sent me a second one because I complained that I didn't get the first one sent. This box is too heavy. What is in this? Yo! Yo, this is legit. Christmas came early. I feel like a kid in a kid. Fuck you, controller. I don't even give a shit. What the fuck? What the hell? Did it? Is this real? Is this really? Did I just really pull this out of a box? Like, this was sent to me? This is sent to me? And this is what I want? I want Evolving Skies. What the fuck? Did this really just happen? I need a clip. I need... Did, what the... with the evolving skies I love it. oh my god fuck, what the hell just happened this is bad really just what the fuck what the fuck hell yeah christmas came actually really what the fuck i need to check my ebay account i can know what happened oh what the hell i never saw a message when i kept looking at it there was nothing ever updated the only thing I ever sent message-wise was, hey, did you send my package? It says it's been sitting in the same spot for a week. Thank you. That's literally all I ever sent regarding the whole thing. I never got a message back. I checked for a week, and then I finally got my package. It was late, but we got it. But what the fuck? Yo, I want to open up the pack right now. I'm not even fucking kidding. I am like, what the fuck? What the fuck, 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 yo, I just got a free fucking Involving Skies booster box, what the fuck, I need, what the fuck, hi, hi, oh, where's my, oh my god, Oh my god, I can't believe this. Might want to make sure it's actually free first. Well, nothing's been taken out of my account. Oh, I'm going to double check that. Uh, I need to check my eBay account now. What the fuck? Just need to double check everything now. That's not shiny. I did click. Just double checking. 
Oops. He sent me a message because of the inconvenience. He sent me out an extra one. Woo! <laughs> oh my fucking god. Dude, what the fuck? Woo! That is fucking legit. Yo! Okay, maybe. Yo. Yo, my god. What the hell, right now? What the hell, this is fucking sweet! Oh my god, I kind of want to open it all right now. I just want to open everything! What the hell? I need a, what the hell? What the hell? I don't do. What the hell? I do do. What the? Just, oh my god! Oh my god! I've got too much excitement going on right now. <laughs> no matter. Really. He's going, he's going to get like the biggest thank you. Maybe a hug, maybe like a Christmas card, maybe like an ass pat, maybe a half merited ass pat with a good play. Uh, he, he's getting a little bit of everything. Um, uh, maybe a swirly, I don't fucking know. Might just like lick my finger, put it in his ear or something. I don't fucking know. Like, he's getting everything. Like what the fuck? A, a fruit basket? Like a fucking a cocktail wiener basket? I don't fucking know. Like, I'll give him a little bit of everything. <laughs> <laughs> oh fucking bouquet of fucking roses, like what the fuck? Dun, 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 dun. Holy crap. Oh this kinda changed my plans going forward. When do I do this? I thought this was the individual card I ordered. <laughs> it is definitely not an individual card. <laughs> um. What the fuck? Should I open? No. No. I don't. I kind of really want to open. What should I do? I don't know what to do. I don't know when to open them. They're just like staring at me in the face already. Like I don't want to. I'm already. Like. Hold on, wait, let me, let me I'll, I'll, I'll show you what I was doing while it's on the table. Yes. My precious, my precious. What the hell? Like, this is real. I'm really open it. I should, maybe, sort of, in a way. Don't crush. Don't crush it. Don't 
but that new opening smell. Maybe I want to save it. <laughs> but I want to open it, my precious. My precious. No, I didn't kiss it. What the fuck are you saying? No. Maybe. In a way. Sort of. Yes. So pretty. So pretty. Booster box. Given to me because of the mistake in the shipping with the last one. I just went to go check the mail and go answer the door and this is my prize, besides the other prize. That's even, yeah, no, two prizes. This one I can share on stream, though. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> like, I haven't put it down. It's mine. It's my precious. What the fuck? I'm, should I open? I really, like, should I open? I, I need a clip. I need a clip of me opening this. I was like, why is this box so heavy? I thought it was my Xerneas card. Like, I got a Xerneas card on the way. It's exactly what I thought it was. And, like, when I opened this and I saw it, yeah, it is. Like, I don't know, like... Because I messaged him where what was happening with my package initially. And all I asked him was, hey, man, uh, I haven't seen it move for over a week. And I remember telling you about that, specifically, Toaster. Uh, and he responded to me, it looks like three or four days later with, hey, man, you're right. I don't know what's going on. I'll send it out. Or I'll send out another one for you for the mistake. And I just never followed up with that message. Yeah, he's a real one for sure. Jesus fucking Christ. Like, my my balls just went into my stomach. I don't even know what to fucking say. <laughs> like, I opened a box. I literally opened this box. And I'm like, oh, it's a little box, whatever, no big deal. I'm like, it's going to be my single card. It's a little heavy, but it's going to be my single card. Woo! <gasps> <gasps> I need to go to eBay and I need to give this dude a five star rating. And this dude, I'm, I'm gonna be like uh, Chris Rock in one of those, uh, the Kanye skit at the end where he's talking about, I'm gonna go shoot a bootlegger for this motherfucker. <laughs> like, this motherfucker is real. Like, what the fuck? What the, what the fuck? I'm just so. I don't have anything set up for an opening right now. Like, next week? No, because I want to do the reversal stream contest. But this is just going to stare at me in the face. This isn't fair. When do you guys think we should do it? Like, for real, for real. Tomorrow or Sunday? I don't think we can do either. Tomorrow? All right, so as I was explaining earlier on stream, we need to get the shiny as elf today so we can move on and get the pokey radar so we can join reversals affiliate and partner contest on his stream and be affiliated with that so we can get a little maybe followers or goals so we need to get that done so the next two days is that so i can't i want to i really do oh trust me i do oh it's precious it's my precious i want it i want it now like in my mouth i want it even though i don't want to eat these i want it in my mouth all right I don't want to eat it, but I want it in my mouth. All right. 
Sunday, I forgot his fucking Pokemon Go community day. I'm gonna do that for like an hour of the six available, maybe. Really depends. Probably most of it from my couch. Not gonna lie. Gonna couch play. Uh, definitely couch play. And then Sunday night we have our stream. We might be able to do it Sunday night and then train for reversal stream thing. But that would be really difficult to reset up everything and re upgrade everything. Monday? No, Monday's the start of the reversal thing, so we'd have to do it like the week after. Tonight, I could be right back screen and adjust everything. Can you really wait till next week? Don't you do this to me. Don't you fucking do this to me. No, but come on. Maybe Friday next week? Question mark. I don't know. Oh, maybe so. Oh, I wasn't planning on doing anything Pokemon card related for a minute. Like, my precious, my baby. It's not weird that I'm petting the box, is it? I don't think it is. I think you're weird. No, it's weird. No, no, no. I think you're weird because you think it's weird. It's a precious box. It's my baby. It's my second favorite thing in my world right now. That's right, I said second. Do I care to share number one? No, I do not! Moving on. My precious. Move back to my precious, actually. That's what we'll do. Yo, I'm actually really hyped on this. Maybe I can use this opportunity. Uh, fuck. Fuck. All right, what is this fucking thing? <laughs> I need to fucking plan this. We're going to make a thumbnail for it tonight or tomorrow or something. I'm going to fucking figure this all out. We're planning this motherfucking shit. I don't like doing it all willy-nilly. We are doing... No, I was searching for reversal. Not myself. Sign up. The goal is the longest chain. The 17th through the 23rd. So the 23rd is... Oh, it's a week. I'd have to do it the following week. The 24th, that Monday, I could do that. And that'd be the week before Pokemon Arceus. That might work. Do it that Monday. Couldn't do it that Friday. The game comes out that Friday. Yeah, I think Monday the 24th. Pack opening stream, Monday the 24th. Yay! We'll say, uh... 7 to 8 p.m., somewhere around there. I'll build up a graphic and I'll post like I normally do. Yay! Holy shit, man. I am flabbergasted. I'm not even going to lie. Even though I am, I can still put words in my mouth. Still. Holy shit. Yay! Hype. That last booster box, honestly, besides that gold card, really sucked. So. We got VMAXs, which was great, but it wasn't what we really wanted. Holy crap, man. 
I'm just at a loss for words. But yet, I still talk. Magical. Crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. We're going to get to 1900 and I'm going to call it a stream today. Uh, 2000 was a pipe dream. That was not going to happen. I was trying to be positive. We'll do 1900. Uh, we'll pick up tomorrow morning. Do an early stream. I need to take off Nightbot before I get offline. Actually, I'll do it between this one right now. Disable, throw back pull, pack giveaway, no friends, B day, no. Do, 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 do. Don't I have a, I thought I had a pack one. Sorry, I'll have to edit those. We'll do it later. No biggie. A lot to do. Whoopity doo. I can't believe that. I am honestly genuinely shocked. That's some real shit right there. A free fucking box. Like, mind blown, mind blown. Do big man, big man. A five hundred dollar Charizard card, god damn. God damn. No, thank you. Early click. Twenty five more tags. We might not even get that far. I'm not even gonna lie. Might just do 80 and call it good. I need to figure out stream going forward in the next week or so. I'm a liar. Yeah, we'll do three more checks and call it good. Damn, cray cray! Shit, it just got real. What would you do if you guys sent a free booster box? Like to make, I did not expect that. Where did I get it? Where did it come in the mail? Open it. I have no delayed gratification. You are today. That's right. 
us, right? Delay that shit. I was just so fucking shocked. Best purchase ever. Even though I got it late, I didn't even really care about like any kind of like um, compensation or anything. I literally just asked. <laughs> what shit. That's it. No. Yay! I mean, yay! Oh, I'll do what I used to do in high school when I was super excited. Hold on, hold on. And I'll, we'll end the last check on it. That. It was me. I take full credit. I did not delay. Thank you for watching, everybody. I appreciate y'all's support. You know it. Thank you for being here. Thank you for watching me be super excited like a kid in a candy store. Um, I hope you're here for the next stream. I hope you have fun. I hope you have a wonderful night. Be safe. Uh, I will be on tomorrow morning, uh, roughly between 8 and 9. That's what I'm going to say. I'm not going to say a time because it ain't going to happen. I'm going to say roughly between 8 and 9. Uh, other than that, I hope you have a good one. Follow me on my Twitch, Twitter, Discord, and YouTube. All my links and the socials are below. Hope you have a good one. Talk to y'all later.